and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kayla Petrie and today I'm here with another makeup video. And I wanted to do something great. I've been really digging like cool tone colors. Um, I really like how this turned out. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel, like this video, and turn on your notifications so you don't miss any future videos from me. If you are interested to see how I got this look, keep watching. So I'm priming my lips today with my Vaseline and then I'm going right into my brows. I'm using my Sephora brow pencil in the color chocolate brown. Taking my foundation stick in NC44 from MAC Cosmetics, I'm just going to use this to clean up and conceal my brows. Now I'm just taking this dense fluffy brush to blend everything out. Today I'm priming my lids with Urban Decay's Potion Primer. I'm setting that with my banana powder from Black Radiance. Taking this gray brown shade, I'm going to start by applying that in the outer V's of my eyes. And then I'm going to change brushes and I'm going to apply that in my crease with a smaller thin crease brush because I don't want the gray to get too crazy I want it to kind of be concentrated and then I'll go back and forth between those brushes by actually blending out the edge of the crease because I don't want it to be in my brows I want it to stay kind of nice and low I'm taking this brown shade it's like a skin tone brown and I'm applying that pretty much as a base before I apply the second shade so now I'm taking that white shade and I'm applying it pretty much all over the lid not to get it too much into the outer V but I'm not looking to have a cut crease or anything like that. I want these colors to really blend seamlessly together. Going back in with that crease brush I'm just going to make sure everything's blended. I'm lining my eyes of course with my Inglotch gel liner in number 77. I'm actually using this eyeliner from Sephora as just just like my brush. I really like how I can apply the liner with this um, pen so I actually just use this to apply the liner for the product not the actual gel. Taking a makeup remover, these are from Target. I'm just using this to clean up underneath my eyes and um, near my line that I apply. I'm tight lining my eyes with Smolder from MAC. And I'm taking my Callus eye glue and I put a layer down first. I put a layer on my lashes and then I apply my lashes. These lashes are called Drag Me and they're from Lash by Coco. I'm using my Lancome primer. This is the Prep and Matte primer. I'm taking a big fluffy brush and applying my Black Radiance banana powder and I'm just doing this to remove any excess oil. So today I'm using my NARS Longwear Foundation in the color Marea and I'm just going to apply that all over my face and even some onto my neck and blend everything out. Because I felt like I needed a little more coverage, I applied my Instant Age Rewind first. And now I'm going into my NARS Concealer in Caramel. And my Instant Age Reminder is also in Caramel. I actually like to add both colors to give it some balance. I think the Caramel is a little too light for me. And I bought it online so I didn't want to exchange it. But I think both colors kind of balance out so it's not too bright. Taking my foundation stick from MAC and NW50, I'm just going to use this to contour my face. And then I'm going to blend that out. And I go back and forth between every brush that I use. I'm going to use my foundation brush to blur any lines. 
and I'm going to use my concealer brush um, on different portions of the face I find that when you do that you really get a, a nice blend and everything is diffused I'm setting all over my face with my Makeup Forever powder in Y445. And today I'm really going in on the banana powder from Black Radiance. Um, I never applied this much, so I wanted to see what it would do. I feel like my face was extra beat, and I probably wouldn't use this much the next time that I use it. But I didn't let it set too long. So I'm taking my Fenty Bronzer and Coco Naughty and I'm applying that everywhere that I've applied um, that NW50 foundation. Taking some more banana powder, I'm carving out my contour and boy was my face beat. Like I said, I didn't let this set too long so I'm just pressing the powder in and once it's pressed in then I'll wipe. Going back in with my Smolder Eye Pencil from MAC, I'm just lining my waterline. Today I use my Burnt Pepper Blush from MAC. Going back into that gray shade, I'm smudging out my waterline. I'm applying mascara with my 3D Dimension Mascara from MAC. I'm using Stubber Brown. It's from MAC. It's actually an eyeliner, but this was the darkest brown that I had. And I'm combining that with the Act Natural lipstick to get this kind of muted gray look. Here's the final look. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. And if you have any suggestions or you would like to see me do a different type of makeup look, make sure you comment below so I can know what you guys would like to see. Thank you so much for watching my video. Peace.